Hello, and welcome once again to the Monday Memo. I'm Pastor David Glesney, Senior Pastor here at St. John's Lutheran Church of Bloomington, Illinois. It's great to have you join us. This week, there is tons of stuff going on. We look forward to you joining us in worship uh, on Wednesday. Ash Wednesday begins the season of Lent. You are invited to join us for the imposition of ashes and Holy Communion. We'll have a service at noon and at 6.30 upstairs in the sanctuary. A wonderful, thoughtful service. We have great scripture. It's a wonderful story. Uh, the last shall be first and the first shall be last. It's a great story from Mark's Gospel. Then uh, heading into the rest of the week, we will begin our Lenten disciplines. People will do different ones, and I encourage you to pick up one as well. One of the ones that a lot of us are doing are um, devotions. Uh, they're written by your, yours truly and Pastor Ann and about five other pastors uh, that focus on the call of Lent in different ways in our lives, using some scriptures that are not usual run-of-the-mills. There's a couple of interesting ones in there, and we invite you to join us to take part in that reflection. You can either download the PDF from our website at stjohnsbloomington.org, or you can pick up a paper copy here at St. John's beginning tomorrow. Those will be printed. And then last but not least, the way I prefer to do it is I've emailed Norma at stjohnsbloomington.org and asked her to put me on the daily uh, devotional list. So every morning when I wake up, there it is in my inbox, ready to go, scripture, the whole nine yards, the word, the photo, uh, everything all right there. So I think that's a wonderful way to do it. I encourage you to do that as well. Then coming up this weekend, we begin our Lenten worship uh, with a big bang. Um, lots of stuff going on this weekend. First and foremost is the Pancake Pig Out for our Noah's Ark, a um, wonderful ministry of St. John's, and we invite you to take part in that. Uh, on worship will be quite different this weekend in some levels. Uh, we will still have our Saturday night service at 5. Our traditional service will begin at 8.30, and then a COJ uh, will be at 10, which is a little different. We don't have two. We'll only have one this weekend. And Joy Zone will also meet at 10 o'clock. Um, and we encourage you to join us for this and go get some pancakes beforehand if you want to do that or afterwards uh, on Sunday. But we'll be meeting and gathering in the, the PLC, the Parish Life Center, uh, downstairs. And we'll begin our service down there with a presentation and worship as to Vision 2020. We'll do the big reveal. Sounds like HGTV, but it's not. It's still very cool, though. Um, and we look forward to showing you the plans and introducing the concept to you for Vision 2020. And we'll begin talking about the capital campaign a little bit as well, where God may be calling you into service in, 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 in that fashion. And then we will head upstairs at uh, the time of the meal after you've eaten. Uh, and we will head upstairs where we'll close out the service with celebration and praise in the sanctuary and give thanks to God for all the great ministry that occurs in and through St. John's and its members, not just the walls of the church, but the people that go into the world in Jesus' name to share his love and mercy. There's lots of other stuff going on. I'm sure there is. I'm not going to go get into all of that. You can find out more on our website or here on our Facebook page. We invite you to look at all of those things and find a way where God is calling you into loving service and to use your gifts for the greater glory of the kingdom of God so that all may come to know of God's love in Jesus Christ. May your week be blessed, and it's good to see you again. Take care. Bye-bye.